morning guys and we tried to make some different type of breakfast this morning cauliflower pancakes now that doesn't look like a pancake we tried making pancakes and they came out they weren't the best but this here attempt we had so much batter left over we're like let's just try to bake it like a loaf in the oven and this is how it came out it's a height nothing uh it's not live lean gv cookbook worthy it's not damn that's good worthy it's just i it's football sunday you know what that means we gotta set our fantasy roster here's what my team's looking like i got my boy there peyton manning i'm actually loaded with broncos of course i'm a big broncos fan wes welker we got sanders there working on a couple deals to get a few more broncos on my squad but we're in first place so i don't want to ruin the chemistry you know how it is who's your favorite football team shot of green tea before we hit the studio to do a little bit of yoga. One of my favorite stretches that I probably I think a year ago couldn't do. And back. Feels such a great stretch right through here, through your hips, through your hip flexors. There's a stretch for you to try. Standing split. This one's called the standing splits. Haven't quite mastered this one yet. You guys really want to see mine? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I, I do really want to see yours. Yeah, put your heel on the ground and walk your hands closer towards your standing leg. Yes, yeah, stretch that one up the top of the wall and make sure that your toes are actually on the walls instead of flat like that. Like we were just talking about if flexibility gains are important, why they're important, and we think it's because, well, you're gonna have to watch Lovely TV to find out. I used to not stretch very much. In my beginner days, I was all about focusing on building muscle, burning fat. Mm -hmm. But in the last year to two years, you know, just as we get to be a little more intelligent with our fitness, we understand flexibility is such a huge important of the overall fitness game. So I've been adding a lot more in. It makes me feel better. It's very important, especially for those hips for you people who sit in office chairs all day and your posture is like this. Oh my God. Number one. I'm gonna show you that again. So this is the way you should do. Tickle the typewriter. What do you call it? Chest up, shoulders back, attractive. This is how people in the office are. To shut it out. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> so that's funny because I remember it's one of the things you said about me when we first started dating was I always had good posture whenever you'd see me. I think I might have said that. I was like, you're hot and you have excellent posture. <laughs> It's true. That's the one like thing you can do to make yourself instantly more attractive is pull them shoulders back and down. Elevate, retract, down. Drop. Yeah. Boom. Doesn't he look sexier? Or this. Yeah. They, well, these are the people that you see at the gym who all they do is train chest. Yeah. So they're just like this all day. <laughs> so their chest, there's no, there's no back movement. None of this to pull those, that chest back. No low motion, it's all yeah. pressing. I know. So they walk around like this. <laughs> pressing. <laughs> yeah. Don't be that guy. Flexibility gains. Is your girl good to you or what? Girl's the best. All right, we're going to the aquarium. You ready, boo? Mm hmm All right. And then we gotta get back in time for the Broncos Football. game. Sorry, I just see all that. Jess is so excited. But let's go to the aquarium, it's gonna be fun. It's like. I'll calm down. You just gave us two exclamation points. I know, that was like three or four. <laughs> all right, we're almost here. It's actually a nice day out. It's nice and sunny out here. There's the Ripley's Aquarium right there where we're going to. And I think it's fairly new as well, so I think it's very. Uh, modern inside, so let's go take a look. Here we go, two tickets, which one do you want? Yay, I'm so excited, I won the manta ray. You want the manta ray? I'll take the squid. Thank you. All right, let's go. I think if I stuck my finger in this guy's mouth, he would bite me. Oh! Ah! <laughs> What's up, buddy? Huh? What's up? Does he look like me? <laughs> Check out this blue lobster here. Guru. So, uh, what's, <laughs> what's for dinner tonight? Pizza. What? I said pizza. So cool. This is 
is like the best Fish part of the whole thing. Everywhere. Look up. Things as a kid, I was terrified of sharks. I still kind of am swimming in the ocean. Yeah. Right here. Ah. <laughs> Holy huge. Oh, wait, wait. Everybody's just moving along on the conveyor belt. Just The big ones are being lazy on the bar. The big lazy ones. He's like, move. Lean. You're like fluorescent. <laughs> really? Freaky. Yeah. Well, look at this one. Guys, look what I just found in the gift shop. Let's go scare Brad. <laughs> Scary. That was hilarious. <laughs> Handstand? That's a good idea. Just don't fall over here. So scary. Even though I have a fear of these sharks over here, I would still come in. This Your love for me is greater? Yeah. Aww. Now, if you kindly exit through the gift shop, I eat. Go buy our shit. Let's go see if I can scare Jess with this. Bah! <laughs> you got me. Payback. You got me. Arr. Smooth. <laughs> Did you have fun at the aquarium, Bilbo? That was fun. Yeah, lots of sharks. Yeah, lots great of time. Jellyfish and cuttlefish. Even though the cuttlefish wasn't very cuddly looking. It's cuttle with a T though. I thought it was cuttle. We had a great time. We saw some sharks. We saw some fish. Now it's time we... to see some Broncos. Nope. All right, we're back home and it is football Sunday. We got the football game on and we got our snacks all lined up here. Got a veggie tray, homemade avocado or guacamole. Got some little mushrooms with stuffed with ground beef, some salsa, some dill white potatoes some more of that ground beef right there that's the way you roll on super or football sunday not quite super bowl yet oh healthy food makes us feel energized so good it tastes damn good too broncos won baby a big win manning is in the 500 td club now awesome game we're taking it all this year Look at Jess in the background, ripping out some of those pull-ups. And we're gonna call it a day. I think we're just gonna chill out, watch Finding Nemo, because we got inspired via the uh, aquarium that we checked out today. Yeah, nice to Very cool, so if you're ever in Toronto, go check out that aquarium. Until tomorrow, thanks for watching. Click that like button. See you at the next episode. Bully. I'll do my best. Word.